unbelievable, my lovely, wonderful people. Our brother, uh, <laughs> Asrida Kubodo Komasaido, he said, Rotimi Amechi was the chief driver of all the pre election cases against Tinubu. He said, he go deal with Rotimi Amechi, say, because Tinubu, now the man, when he's supposed to rule Nigeria at this point in time, he says, so everybody with the fight, when they don't make uh, Nigeria move forward, they don't make Tinubu come in, on board, he, they watch all of them, he get all of them their list, he get all of them for their hand. He says, so Rotimi Amechi, you know, say it the watch him. Say the watch and carefully say get evidence of what him what me amichi do. Well Roti Miamichi is a, is a man who came second to Ashiwa Ahmed Bolatinobu in APC primaries. When APC primaries was conducted, he came second. Yeah. Uh, some people thought that he was going to become the president, but uh, Buhari, uh, Buhari, 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 Buhari deceived the guy, travel, travel, give a long jump, you know, run, leave her. Uh -huh. So now what did they happen with this? Everybody, they watch and we they see how things go play out and uh, we know meetings continue the same way we them be because right about now, Nigeria really needs you know, Nigeria, really, things really need to change. We need to move forward. We need to advance and we need, really need to know where we are at as a nation and as a people. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like us, share, subscribe. Rotimi Amechi was the chief driver of all the pre-election cases against Bola Metinubu. As Siri Dakubo says, I will deal with him. I want to deal with Anna. As Siri Dakubo, a prominent Nigerian figure, has via a live stream video on Facebook accused the former late the former governor of River State, Rotimi Amechi, of standing against Bola Ahmed Tinubu's ambition. He made this claim while speaking on issues Tinubu experienced before winning the 2023 election, which INEC declared him the winner. He stated that APC had a Muslim Muslim ticket, and as he said in the video, when Tinubu picked Shetima as running mate, they Christians came out and kicked against it, against the Muslim Muslim ticket. Many of them were people who has benefited greatly, directly or indirectly, from Bola Ahmed Tinubu. Look at Lawa. Tinubu nominated him. He was one of the people who who purposely said that he brought form for Tinubu to contest for the presidency. He really did not have it or his own way. He stood against Tinubu. They are all the same thing. I'm waiting patiently for Rotimi and I will deal with him. Rotimi Amechi was supposed to be an APC man, but he stood against Tinubu, thinking that Tinubu will be disqualified and he will come on board. We know him, we are waiting for him. Accu accusing Rotimi, he said from the video, that after Tinubu won the election, Rotimi Amechi was the chief driver of all the pre election cases. I am an insider. I know what I'm doing. I know what I'm saying. And we, we are coming for Rotimi. We will hold all these things against him. Let Tinubu be sworn in. Those of them that stood against Tinubu, we have themselves to blame. We know what is going on and we are prepared for them. We are coming for every single one of them. They should keep sharing crocodile tears. They are jealous and every one of them has benefited greatly from Tinubu at, at one point or another. So they should keep deceiving themselves. So this is what is happening. This is what, you know, this is what is going on. And um, uh, everybody is watching and everybody is seeing what is going on. Everybody is watching it very carefully. Nigerians are beginning to ask themselves very serious questions. Okay, I was asking themselves very serious question that how did this how did these things get this far? Where who are these people and why do they keep lying and deceiving the, the whole country, you know, making things you know just for themselves? It ought not to be so. These are people who should really and sincerely speaking be standing up for the nation and standing up for Nigerians. Most of them are just doing things for themselves. It's sad, but it's the true occurrence of what is going on. Very sad if you ask me. Very sad, really, truly sad. You know, it ought not to be so. Every one of them knows. Every one of them are their hands really clean. Eh? Are their hands really clean? Eh? It is sad, though. It is sad. Honestly, it is sad. You know, wrote to me, you know, of course, he came second. Okay, he gives came, came second, and you know, and uh, everybody, you know, looking forward to say, ah, guys, so, uh, of course, he wanted to win. Then the vice president came third. According to what we heard, the vice president came third. 
you know, but uh, Siri Dakubo is saying that he has evidence to prove that Rotimi was fighting Tinubu and that um, he is coming for Rotimi, he will deal with Rotimi and that uh, Rotimi stood against Tinubu and um, he has evidences beyond beyond description that he's going to deal with Rotimi and prove to Nigerians that indeed uh, Rotimi is fighting Tinubu. He said that every one of them, according to him, have benefited from Tinubu. So why should they be the one, you know, speaking against him? You know, Asiri Dakubo will not stop, tell, you know, he will tell everybody what he has benefited. He said when he was in prison and nobody remembered, and he remembered what was going to happen to his family. He said Tinubu, Tinubu went there, took his family, his wife, his children. He said he will never forget Tinubu. So that thing alone Tinubu did to him made him see that, that indeed human being can come in angel's form. You know, he said Tinubu went there, he was the only one who took care of his family. He was the only one who stood with his wife, gave them, uh, you know, accommodation, feeding money. His children, he put them in school. He paid their school fees until he returned. And when he returned, he said Tinubu helped him get got back on his feet. He said, so, so how is it? He cannot see anything wrong in Tinubu. Neither can he speak against Tinubu. And anyone who wants to fight Tinubu, the person has to go through him. So Rotimi, he said, he's watching Rotimi. And as soon as uh, Tinubu is sworn in, he's coming for all who stood against Rotimi. He said he's coming for all. In case you are not aware, he has applauded uh, the governor of River State. And all of a sudden, they have turned sweethearts. Before he not like Wiki, Wiki not like him. But in recent videos he has been doing, he has really applauded Wiki. He said Wiki is a man of honor. He says he's a great man. What Wiki did, oh, they've not seen that kind of thing before. Wiki went out of his way and came to support Tinubu. That Wiki really showed, you know, that um, he's a man who understands what is going on. You know, so anybody who does not uh, who does not support Tinubu, you are as if you want to make yourself a Tinubu enemy, you are also an Assyria Dakubo's enemy. So in case you want to choose your battle, know before you choose your battle. Not be smarty the apples, everybody in a lot of, hey Niger, Niger, not be smarty the grano. Now the matter we see the watch, we see the observer. We are doing some serious observation in all of this to understand, you know, where things are going. Anyway, my people, now the matter you they see, so now they hit us, so back, 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 boss, 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 boss. You never know, they watch the old thing, where they watch and say, where say, things are like this. So, my dear, what do you think? What do you think? What do you think? How do they see the matter? What do you think? Remember, say, today, hey, we all, Nigerians, so now we, they make, we go stand for what we believe. Oh. Leave us a comment. Don't forget to like us, share, subscribe. God bless. Bye for now.